quick unboxing of the cooler 620 water cooling solution kit one of the best value performance and values out there <clears throat> $74 for shipping and really the next highest up kit that's available is the H70 I think it's by Thermaltech and that's like 110 and this has you know roughly comparable performance to it at you know a quarter less than a quarter you know a quarter less the cash so that's what I got I'm gonna I need to get the back plate installed on the board so I can uh, before I, I want to do that before I put the motherboard in although I could do it afterwards since I have a cutout in the back of the case but I'd rather do it now so I'm going to take some of this plastic off Alrighty. Side for now. It's open. Um, this baby is compatible with most everything. It's compatible. It has brackets for socket 775, as well as uh, 1356, uh, 1156. Pretty much, this baby is compatible with most everything. Here are some uh, of the specs on here. So this would, is an example of cooling with a stock cooler, cooling with a liquid cooler. Includes um, 120 millimeter radiator fan, which will which screws on, well 120 millimeter fan which will screw on to the radiator. Here's the radiator. It's a completely self-contained kit. Does no, never needs changing fluids. Nothing very simple to do. Very lightweight. There's a nice copper block on that, and it already comes with a thermal paste on it, so you don't have to worry about that. A little plastic cover covering that. So, 120 millimeter Antec fan. You, could, you don't have to use that. You can use whatever fan you want. And various brackets for different sockets. For different socket CPUs. And your instruction manual for installation. And so. These would be some of the uh, back plates that come with it that would install on the back of your motherboard. And these fit on top of the cooler. And pretty much to put it on, you would put 
it goes on here and it sockets in. Kind of twists on. So it goes from the top and you screw it in. Very simple. And uh, that's about it. So, um, as far as installation, the radiator will screw. On the back of my case here, to the back of the uh, 120 millimeter fan. Of course, I could use the case fan that came with it, but I think I'll put the Antec one in there. The one that came with the cooler. And there you have it. Here's the back of my motherboard. See the holes there? And let me see which one of these fits. Yeah, it looks like this. It wouldn't be this one. Let me double check. Yeah, it would be this one. Alright, that's it. There you have it. Brief unboxing of the Antec Cooler 620.